The Way Home, all new season. Sunday, January 21st at 9, only on Hallmark. Okay, season two of The Way Home, congratulations. I love this show so much. Describe the season in three words. Oh my God. Is that right? Oh my God. <laughs> it works because that's what I was, my jaw was on the floor for the end of season one and I said, oh my God. So yeah, season two is another, oh my God. Oh, it's more, oh my God. -y. I love yes. that. Yes. If you could time travel to any era, what era would you go to and why? Uh, you know, I think maybe, I had said at one point the 20s, but I think the 70s would be really fun. Yeah. Yeah, like the, like the early 70s. That's where I'm going. Is that, is that where we're yeah. going? Yeah, we're going to the okay, 70s. Going I have the, the sunglasses for it. I'm ready to go. Oh, excellent, excellent. Okay. Now, I have truly fallen in love with so many of the actors on the show, but I have to know, who would be your dream guest star? Oh. Yeah, there we go. Cher. Sure. Can I say Cher? Absolutely, absolutely. Cher, hello. Hello. Yeah, hello. Cher, can you come and play with us, please? Thank you. I love it. Now, we are still have secrets. So what is one fun fact or behind the scenes moment from filming the show that you think fans would be interested in knowing? Um, I would say that some of the pond days where we had to jump into the water, because it was an actual, real natural pond, um, the last time I went, it was actually 51 degrees. So we have to wear very specifically cut down wetsuit pieces mm. underneath our clothes, um, which is funny because it helps keep out the cold, but it also makes us more buoyant. So we have to like really work to get all the way back down. So it's kind of silly, but at the same time, it's like, it, it, it's helpful. Yeah. I will say that for sure. That is definitely a secret. That's yeah. that's one for sure. Now I feel the viewership of the show spans so many generations well, as we've seen in the show itself. What do you think was, it was about The Way Home that resonated so deeply with the audience? Well, I, I do think because we keep things very raw and real and kind of guttural and we don't really, we don't paint a pretty picture on everything and we're really trying to um, show the fact that relationships are they're broken they're not always going to be perfect and between mother daughter mo mo mother daughter mother daughter I had to do the math there for a second um, yeah it's gonna look like something different for everybody and what I love so much is that we've gotten so many compliments from from fans and viewers that have said you know, even though maybe I, I don't have the exact scenario, I can find myself in these characters. Mm -hmm. Like, and, and that, I mean, it, that just goes to show that we're doing something right. Yeah, that is a beautiful message for sure. And I did hear all about the swear jar on set between you and Andy McDowell. You guys like to maybe drop, drop a few F-bombs. I have, you? Really? Okay, because I was going to say, well, that's what I need to know. Who made the most donations during season two filming? Yeah, right here. So, so, so Andy's kind of came in like spurts. There were sort of like rapid fire. Mine were consistent. So I was, yeah, I'm, I'm the one to make like some ridiculous, inappropriate joke um, at like really super random times. I'm the kind of person that cries in or, or laughs in inappropriate moments. So I'm, 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 I'm that one. Yeah. Guilty as charged. Yeah. And the fandom is amazing. They are so loyal. Honestly, at the end of season one, I hopped online. I had to see what everyone was talking about, and they are definitely talking. Have you seen one funny or crazy fan theory that stuck out to you? Oh my gosh, no! Just from the get go, we've we've had so many people kind of like write in and give their theories, and some of them were so bang on. Very early in the beginning, we're just like, listen, Carol, I bet, like. <laughs> We have so many people coming up with these theories that you're just like, okay, these are super sleuths. Yeah. And and that being the case, it's actually quite quite fun to see people kind of come up with their own things. And we have had some people be pretty close, uh, but then some other really wacky ideas that I particularly think is right. I know I laugh at the wacky ones. Yeah, but you have to. You have to. I mean, it's funny. I see a lot on there, and I'm like, you might be a little bit off, but. Yes. Anyways, thank you so much for speaking with me. Congratulations on tonight. This is amazing. I'm excited. Thank you so much.